If you're an organization that needs to check out devices to your end users, you're probably familiar with the challenges of keeping all those devices charged, controlling who has access to them, and keeping track of everything. TechArc Connect from Bretford solves all of those needs with a single solution, a device charging locker featuring built-in power in every bay to ensure laptops, tablets, phones or other technology assets are secure, charged and ready to go. Access to devices is restricted to authorized locker users with authentication via RFID or PIN code, and the entire system is cloud managed, giving you the ability to check real-time locker activity remotely from the web. Once configured, TechArc Connect's unique check-in check-out mode is completely self-service, allowing users to loan devices autonomously without the need for an admin intervention. To get started, simply follow these three easy steps. Step one, register your locker users. Before a user can check out their first device, they must first be registered so the system knows who they are and what they are allowed to access. Locker users can be added one at a time, imported in bulk via spreadsheet or automated using Connect developer APIs. Once you've entered the user's information, Ensure asset loans are enabled and select how your users will authenticate at the locker. In this example, we've selected a five digit PIN. This numeric passcode is unique for each user and will be used to identify them when checking out a device. Once you've registered all of your locker users, it's time to move on to step two, adding assets. Assets are added to the system to help identify which devices have been checked out by users and to set permissions around who can borrow them. In addition, Connect can record details about the asset, including its name, type, and serial number. You can also set how long the asset can be borrowed before it is due back and fine-tune permissions determining who is allowed to check an asset out. To minimize the chance of someone receiving a device with a depleted battery, a required charging time will prevent a return device from becoming available immediately after it has just been checked back into the locker. Now that we've added an asset to connect, it's time to assign it into a locker bay. First, select the locker you're planning to put the device in and find an available bay. Click the device icon, search for the asset name, and save changes to assign the device. Afterwards, remember to take the device over to the locker and insert it into the correct bay. The device is now ready to be checked out from the locker. Upon successful authentication, the user will be granted access to the device, and a record of the transaction will be logged in the cloud so you can maintain complete accountability. Thanks for taking time to learn about device check and check out with TechArt Connect. For more information, visit us at www.bretford.com slash connect slash locker for more information.